Hi, I'm Chef Peter, professional chef, and today I'm showing you how to make apple and raisin stuffing. For our apple and raisin stuffing, we start off with our ingredients and sauteing them in the pan. First we start with our celery, two ribs of celery, adding half cup onions to it, and gives it just a little bit color, like you want it just slightly sauteed. Then we add our apples to it, one whole apple, two tablespoons of butter, so now we can add a half cup of raisins. And now the butter is pretty much dissolved. And we can add our one cup of chicken bouillon and bring it all to a boil. We want to add the sage at the end of the whole process because we still want the sage to have the light green color and sage contains esoteric oils and if you heat them up too long the oils will all vaporize and it defeats its purpose. One teaspoon of sage. And now we are be able to add three cups of cubed white bread and mix them all nicely together. So we have our stuffing mix. You want to create a nice doughy mixture, like almost like a, a soft cookie dough. And let's put them in our fire resistant forms, where we can really nice bake them. And they should come out really nice and golden brown. This is a very nice side dish for every Thanksgiving dinner accompanying your turkey or your ham or your roast it's very festive hearty and a perfect beautiful fall dish now we got our stuffing in the fire resistant forms and we can put them in the oven at 350 degrees for about 30 minutes here we go i will see you back in about 30 minutes 30 minutes are over now and our apple and raisin stuffing should be ready to take out of the oven. It should be golden brown and really nice. So let's see. And here we go. Our golden brown apple and raisin stuffing. 